just read a report in the i newspaper i'll just read it out because it's um not long uh but i've kind of followed this up in other sources so um cafe fined twelve thousand euros twelve thousand euros over slam ei's cup and this is um uh quote unquote starbucks cafe in dublin has been told to pay twelve thousand euros that's about ten thousand seven hundred pounds in compensation to a customer after an employee drew slanty eyes again that's uh, in inverted commas on her matcha tea latte cup last year Sukhavadi foley who is of high origin took the action against uh atrochin liffey unlimited which trades a starbucks talent um talent a suburb of dublin of course um that's just to me insane Twelve thousand euros 12,000 euros for basically what amounts to um, racial insensitivity and hurt feelings. Um, so firstly, the barista that done this apparently is uh, Brazilian. Uh, so when this went to trial, it was, there had to be a translator. Uh, Starbucks on reserve, they apologised. Uh, they said that it was a misunderstanding, but they will fully retrain the, st the staff at that branch. Um, I'm not going into all the details here because I've, I've got limited space, but I think this is a good example of where racial sensitivities in Western countries can detract from common sense, to put it one way. Um, I can understand the customer being annoyed by that, um, maybe even humiliated and uh, degraded, as she said. Uh, you know, I'm not justifying it. I'm not going to say it's trivial. Uh, the barista says she thought the customer was glamorous and that's why she's done it. Starbucks, of course, has a, a kind of tradition of writing the names of customers on the cups. And she obviously took it a step further. Now, it was inappropriate and she shouldn't have done it, but I just can't get my head around that amount of money. €12,000. You could buy a second-hand car with that. Um, and it seems, what, what sort of message is this sent? It, it basically sends a message that if you feel that you are um, insulted in a racial way, not attacked, not even discriminated against, but merely that your feelings are hurt, then you could get a pretty hefty payout. Um, I suppose the logic would be Starbucks is a multi-billion dollar company, but what if this was a small family business? Probably wouldn't be that sort of payout. But I, to me, that's just... You know, any sympathy that I would have for this woman goes when I read that sheer amount. And needless to say, you would not get this sort of situation in Asia, where I'm sure there are white people mocked all the time. But white people wouldn't sue for it because it wouldn't be it wouldn't be possible. I think there is um an intense sensitivity in Western countries around race. Um and I think there's different reasons for this, but, you know, I mean, th this is the Republic of Ireland. If that was America, it would probably be even higher, an even higher payout. I think it's, frankly, absurd. I think a sufficient response would have been to apologise to the customer, maybe to have retraining, um, apologise to the customer, uh, maybe even give her a free coffee or something, or a bit more than that, say a, a voucher for numerous free coffees. But really, uh, 12,000 euros? That blows my mind. It's actually quite hard to find all the sources for this. I've Googled it um, I'm on Facebook to see if any sort of news archives was covering it. There were a few Thai sites, and but it didn't seem to get very many responses, which is surprising. Um, but yeah, that's madness. I mean, her lawyer has obviously pushed aggressively for this. Um, but in my line of thinking, um, if she takes the money, then she's just greedy. I think, you know, if it was me, if I'd been racially insulted, of course I'd be annoyed, and I'd probably take some money. But if it was that vast amount of money, I'd be certainly given a hefty amount to charity. It's just, it's crazy. If you live in Dublin or Italic, let me know your thoughts on this. But I... I personally think this is another example of how racial issues in the West are so, frankly, overblown. Uh, it should be said the customer is an Irish citizen of Thai descent. 
No, I'm not. I can understand her being annoyed. That's not my issue here. I'm not saying that she should just laugh it off or something. You know, that's, it was inappropriate. And the barista should have known better. But I just can't accept that £12,000, €12,000 is an appropriate consequence of that. That's insanity. And that'll be, I'm not a lawyer, there'll probably be some legal loophole that justifies that, but blows my mind.